What's up tribe? How you guys doing? Go ahead and hit that subscribe button and I hope you like this video. This is, listen, the girls are fighting, okay? They are down to the Twitter, Instagram, social medias, and they are fighting over father love, right? Diddy changed his name to love. It should be all love, right? Anyway, let's go ahead and get into the getting to this. So, you may or may not know that there's been, you know, uh, that uh, Diddy has been rumored to be dating or at least frolicking on some level with the city girl, Young Miami, right? We know that, you know, they've been flirty, flirty. They've been seen together at different situations. And, and even for her birthday, he, you know, rented out an island for her to party and frolic with her friends. She called it Love Island, right? So... We know that Sunday night he hosted the Billboard Awards. A woman by the name of Gina something or other, she posted on her Instagram with Diddy in the background saying, my baby daddy. You know, Diddy was on stage, whatever. So this has sparked a whole Twitter war between the two women. Now, I have yet to see Diddy say anything. I have yet to see Diddy tap in. Um, now, let me give you a little background on Miss Gina. Now, Miss Gina is somebody that Diddy has messed with in the past. So, they are familiar with each other. They know each other. Now, she allegedly claims that Diddy assaulted her to the point where she ended up having a miscarriage. So, I find it very interesting that you would choose that caption, my baby daddy. So, let's get into some of, because I say some, because baby, I might have missed some stuff. Let's get into some of the... The, 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 the tweets or Instagrams back and forth. So when she posted the video, Young Miami's response was, somebody please give this B some attention. So then she posts a picture of Diddy kiss Gina posts a picture of Diddy kissing her. And the picture does look sort of current. Um, I mean, you, you never know about these things, but the outfit, the shirt she has on would give the implication that this is not from five years ago or four years ago when they were together before. Um, and so of course, young Miami responds to that. It says, if somebody, um, she says, um, oh, she said, if somebody is seeking attention, it's you. That's what Gina says to young Miami. So then young Miami posts a video of Whitney, one of those famous memes of Whitney Houston, when she's receiving an award and she's like, you better lay low. Y'all seen it. Y'all seen the meme. Um, so she did that. And then she posted, attention, B, I'm the attention, let's be clear. Uh, then, I'm sorry, let me keep going. Then Miami says, I ain't arguing with no B that got cheap ass lint ball carpet in their house. Messing with a billionaire, you freaky bleep, bleep, bleep. Okay, so I don't know if that means that Diddy done showed this woman pictures of the girl's house or what, but... She said that her house got cheap lint. I don't cheap carpet. I don't know. So then Gina responds, "Why you so pressed, Mama? I thought you was a city girl. I don't think that Gina. Now I don't know if you want that that heat. I don't think you want her to show you what kind of a city girl she is. Baby, she from Miami. Do you know the people that's from Miami? Do you know the thing? I just don't think you want that. So young Miami responds, "I am, and that's why I f with yo." Is and ain't coming off of him. I don't care how many pics you post. I mean, so then she drops a clip of a song. So that's the little clip of the song. Hope I don't get a copyright for that. Anyway, so then I guess um, she felt the need to clear up her her nationality. She says she's Vietnamese and black. Um, I don't know what the purpose of that was supposed to be. But yeah, she posted that little clip saying new music coming soon. Um, then Young Miami says that... <laughs> Gina owes her 20% for the marketing fee. <laughs> Y'all, listen. So then I guess somebody asked about the um, alleged abuse claims. Um, because I believe at one point, I think somebody, um, Tisa Tells, I believe, said that um, 
she did an interview with Tasha K. So uh, exposing Diddy. So anyway, uh, so here's a so, so I guess somebody asked her about now. She got a blue check mark down to the Instagram. But anyway, I guess somebody asked her about this situation with um her and Diddy, and so she says um um that they were she was young. Her, everything between her and Diddy is cool. They made up a long time ago. She said, um, that stuff was in the past. The stuff, the, the fact that he beat you to the point where you lost the baby, but okay. Him and I both have moved on. I never lied about anything. I forgave him a long time ago, and he treats me like a queen and a princess. Now, I don't know about you, you a queen or a princess. You can't be, well, I mean, I guess technically you can be both, but girl, you a queen or you a princess, girl. We did stop speaking to each other at one point for eight months, and then we became friends again, and our friendship is better than before. We just really care about each other and want to be in each other's lives. I'm sorry to every woman I let down because a lot of y'all did support me, and I do feel bad, but I personally don't think it's a big deal if we both changed for the better and it's all love. If he was still mean to me, if he was still mean to me, I wouldn't have allowed us to remain friends. Girl, this is all I'm going to say. I get it that maybe all of this stems from the amount of zeros that are in Diddy's bank account. Because I'm not calling you love. Your name is Diddy. I'm not doing this with you again, okay? I, I changed from Sean to Diddy. I'm not going from Diddy to love. I'm not doing it. Anyway, um... I, I'm I'm sure that this has a lot to do with the amount of zeros in his bank account. I'm just going to go call a spade a spade, okay? But Gina, you out here looking real foolish. I'm just going to say it's Gina that's looking foolish uh, for a couple of reasons. One, because you went on a whole campaign about how badly this man assaulted you to the point where you lost a child. And then you choose to caption my baby daddy. Anyway, the girl's a girl. Y'all let me know what y'all think. I will talk to y'all later. Peace.